Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel family. It is your girl Stephanie and I'm back on your screen with another video today. I'm not gonna get in the camera, honey, because I don't have on any clothes right now. However, I do have some things that I want to show y'all as far as uh, what I've done down here in the downstairs. Let me turn on the light in here too and in the kitchen. Never mind this, because this gotta go out. I'm about to give y'all like a slight little tour of some changes I've made. And I want to show y'all the um, the stuff I put out from the hall. So let's have a look at the living room first. So this is what you see when you come in out of the kitchen and the dining room into the living room. I still have my rugs layered and I added the jute rug. Y'all, I did this at like, I started at like three o'clock in the morning and I finished at like five. I just was up, y'all. So this is what the living room looks like from here. With the, the rugs layered like that, I moved around some plants. That's the macrame hanging in the center of the curtains right there. And that is just so pretty, y'all. It really, really is. Like, and I'm, I, I don't have one. Let me turn, let me see. Let me turn this lamp on over here. Because I, I didn't want to open up the blinds this morning because, well, right now, it's not even morning. I don't want to open them up right now because I'm trying to show y'all the, the, um, the window. So I moved around um, some plants. And this is what that space looks like now. I love it. It's so much better. It's less is more. And I just, I don't know. It just kind of fell together as I was doing it. And so I'm really, really, really liking how this area has turned out. I still have my mirror sitting over there because I got to still hang those. And I would have done that um, in the a.m. while I was doing everything else. But again, it was three, four o'clock in the morning and I wasn't trying to be drilling in the wall, you know, disturbing my neighbors. So I'm actually gonna do that today. I'm getting ready to hang those and I'm getting ready to show you where I'm gonna hang them. This little thing right here that y'all saw in the hall, it ended up over here on this shelf. So this is what this shelf looks like with that. And then I moved around some other stuff over here. You probably didn't really know what was on this shelf anyway, but I added my little pink scent bird down there. I added the um love birds i still gotta take the tag off i want to see how it look and it's still hanging there i added the candle um the this candle here i added this over here i added this was already here but i just rearranged it and then i set this little thing here so i like that so much better the the kissing birds on this shelf that is so nice and this is the glance from over here where I am by the stairs. And then that is the table. I took the blue candle off of the table and I put my initial and I added the little glasses, the little heavy glasses over there um, that was sitting over here on this shelf where the bird is. And it just looks so much better over there. This is the sofa with the new pillows. And what I love about this is that you could just really see my couch. Like you could just see, I, I decided not to use um, the throw that I bought because you could just really see the detail of my couch with it just having the four pillows. The macrame pillow up against the green feather down pillow, um, the pink pillow and the citron. I'm gonna call this what they call it because it is it's not really yellow, but it is that, I guess that that's why they call it citron. But I think that those two colors look gorgeous together. I love these two pillows over here together. I think that these colors have just really, really, really fell in place with my couch. And again, I'm just really getting that less is more vibe from down here now. And I'm just really loving it. Like, I feel like I'm just really feeling my living room and what it is I've been wanting to see. So this looks really pretty y'all and i'm not gonna put a throw on here because i just didn't need it the throw was actually taken away from my couch i felt like my couch was doing too much 
So, um, so yeah, so that's what the couch looks like with just the pillows. I took away the tall lamp that was over here, the tall silver lamp, and I brought the rattan lamp from my room and I just put that over there, which I like a lot. I think that looks cute. So I'm gonna give y'all a glance with that. That looks really cute over there. Still searching for something for this wall, which I think I'm going out to the at-home store to do today because I got a store credit with them and I need to use it. This here, this was a plant pot that one of my peach lilies was sitting in. Now, remember, I think it was um, Tahitia. Shout out to you, sis. I think it was either you or Peggy that said I could go and get some flower foam and... Um, use that to keep my grass inside the other taller vase that I had originally bought it for in the Amazon haul when I did the cabinet. But I put this over there on the table because remember this had that little black lamp and it had some candles and some succulents and some other stuff over here when I did the decorate with me at night uh, video. I removed all of that from over here and I just thought that this plant pot was so pretty with all that detail on it and the color of it just sitting over here on this table. So I pulled my grass, my little uh, faux grass out of the closet and I just kind of like arranged it inside of that, um, that pot and it's just nothing to it. That's just how it's sitting in there. That's how I got it. So I just arranged it like that so it'll hang out the sides like that and I think that that is absolutely gorgeous. That is one of my favorite <laughs> things that I did down here. And I love the way it looks with everything else. I love the way it looks with the sofa and that green, you know, that's there. The green, the green color with that uh, turquoise. The turquoise goes with some of the pictures, like in pulling the turquoise out of that picture on the wall. And also, of course, the curtains. Um, or I don't know if you would necessarily call this turquoise. I don't know what color this blue is. But it's all just working together. And that is just so pretty, y'all. Like, I'm really in love with what I did. Okay? And so that's what this is looking like. And then, let me give y'all a, a, a close-up on the macrame because I didn't do that. The macrame looks so pretty hanging here. It really does make the living room feel better. I like that this shelf is not, um, I like that the yellow cabinet is not sitting there no more. I like that this um, macrame is just giving me that bohemian vibe that I want down here. You know, I can continue to add too, but I just like how this just, it's just like not a whole lot going on over there no more where you could just really focus on what's going on, right? So over here, I moved the yellow shelf to this wall or the yellow cabinet to this wall. And the two mirrors that I bought from Ross, which are sitting there, I am going to hang right there above it. That's my favorite vase that I told y'all I love so much. I plan to go find some um, pompous grass or something, some kind of um, plants or something to go inside of the vase because I think it looks really pretty sitting over there on that yellow. And it'll look pretty once the mirrors go up too. So, um, that's really nice. I like how I just, you know, did that. And then all the shoes that were sitting over here are down here in this cabinet. And then my grocery bags, my shopping bags that I take with me and just some other stuff, incense, extra candles that I ain't using, stuff that I just pulled away, you know, shoe covers, all that is down here. Perfect. This is just perfect, y'all. So what I have sitting over here is just, um, this was some stuff that was on the end tables. Those two succulents, that little container with the top on it. I love that little detail, that little design on there. Um, and then I have, of course, like I said, my favorite vase. I was burning the incense, uh, incense while I was cleaning. So that's what that is. And then I just have this big black candle here that I got from Marshall's quite some time ago. I love the detail on the top of it. So I thought this was nice sitting over here. And then I have my um, diffuser with my essential oils. And then those um, two wooden bowls right there just stacked on top of each other. That's just all I have right there. So 
I like this. I think that once I get the mirrors put up, that's going to add so much to that, you know, space right there. And I just think that the yellow cabinet is in the perfect space for this living room. So this is what it's looking like, y'all. Still feeling like I want to do something here, though. But it would just really have to be something, you know, <laughs> special to go right there. But that's the mirror. I'm thinking that I may want to put another chair over here. I may buy me another Papa's on chair. Um, I may buy me a white one or something like that and a bigger one. The one I had last time was a really nice size, but I want to do a different one. And I think I want to go with a Papa's on chair again because that Papa's on chair will still, you know, give me that um, will fall in with my boho chic uh, decor. So I can't talk this morning, y'all. Okay, so that's that on the living room. And no worries on that. That's just sitting there. I just got that sitting there because I am, that's one of my plants where I've pulled it apart. I've done some cuttings, and I'm trying to dry the roots out a little bit. Um, I don't water it that much, but for whatever reason, it was still like, the, the dirt was still really moist. So I just pulled it out, and I'm letting the roots dry out so that they don't get um, root rot. Cause I don't know why it was still wet and I don't even water it that much. So I'm guessing because it was sitting down in that basket and maybe it was just not being aired out enough. I don't know what it was, but anyway, that was the pot that was, that was the plant that was sitting in that pot and I, in that basket and I have torn it up so I can redo it. And so, yeah. So right now this space just looks like this. I can leave it this way or get another chair, and I'm sure I get another chair. So, um, this is what's going on in the living room. Love it. Love that I could just really see my couch. It's just really doing something different in here with me being able to see the couch the way I can now. Because I just really did not need all of that. You know, it was just kind of too many pillows, and it wasn't really too many pillows. It was just that throw. This might just be the kind of couch that just don't need to throw. To me, the design of it, the sleekness or whatever, it just speaks for itself. And I just think that the pillows that the, uh, again, I can't talk today. The pillows that are on it just really, 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 I don't know, that gray. It's just, it's just doing something for me, girl. So, yes. So, this is the update on the living room. Come through here to the dining room. This is what you see. Again, pay no attention to the trash. Have my water over here. Y'all know I put down the rugs. Here we are with the dining room area. I mean, the uh, dining room table where it still looks the same with the apples and everything on it. And I did get a chance to hang my bottles inside of the macrame. And they're the same bottles. And I also added plants in here. Isn't that pretty? I'm going to actually go let this window up, y'all. Let this window up, yeah. Isn't that pretty with the plants sitting over here? It feels so different in here, y'all. It really does. It just feels different with the plants being in there. It feels so much more closed in, so much more like home. This is just gorgeous. I mean, I, I spread out my plants and I love it. I don't know why I didn't think of that at first, but I, sometimes I guess I just have to do things off camera, y'all. Maybe that's just it because I just was like, I was up last night and I was like, I'm just not sleepy. And so I was down here on my couch. I don't know what I was down here doing. I think I was washing my dishes or something. I had a few dishes left in the sink after um, I came back from the Feast of Passover and I was just up. I couldn't sleep. So I started washing those few dishes. And honey, one thing led to another girl. I was cleaning the kitchen, pulling everything off the counter, wiping down. Honey, I had done did all this. And uh, I had to <laughs> got the living room together, child. It was 6.30 when I went upstairs, 6.30 a.m. And it's only like almost 1 p.m. now. So I'm, I'm, I ain't been sleep. I didn't get that much sleep, but I know I'm going to grab a nap today. But it just looks so pretty in here. It really does. I mean, it just, those plants are really just, I don't know. Like I said, I guess maybe I just have to do things off camera sometimes to get that, you know, just to kind of just be with myself and collect my thoughts. And I'm not having to position the camera this way and position the camera that way. And, you know, sometimes, even though this is a home decor channel, sometimes that can happen, y'all. So, 
Maybe I just needed to get with myself and just say, okay, something is not working together for the good of me. <laughs> so what am I going to do about that? And this is what I did. And I just think that everything is just looking wonderful. Once again, disregard that trash, honey, because she got to take that out today. And so, yeah, so y'all, I'm very, very, very proud of the space. I really am. I mean, I'm just like, the plants just brought everything together. And the bottles, the dark bottles up there and the macrame just brought everything together. Thank you to everybody that did comment about that in the last video, you know, because I asked y'all what you thought. And I do think that the, I always like the darker bottles, but I just wanted to see what y'all thought. And yeah, it just, it's just making that pop over there. So pretty, so pretty. So yeah, y'all, girl, I be knowing what I be doing, girl. I just have to kind of just think about it. Because see, I know how I be wanting to feel. You know what I'm saying? And I just wasn't feeling how I wanted to feel. But now... This is wonderful. Okay. So I didn't really do much in the kitchen. I just cleaned in here. Uh, y'all, I forgot. I have the collard green video coming for y'all. It's a vlog. The one that uh, I said one of our sisters, Carmel, um, asked me to do. I did that. It's a long vlog. As a matter of fact, it's like 53 minutes. So um, I forgot to do the boiled bananas. I forgot. They still sitting over here. And I was so tired um, yesterday trying to cook for Passover and all that kind of stuff. I was just tired, y'all. And um, I forgot to do the bananas. And I think one of the reasons I forgot is because I fried some chicken the uh, couple nights before. And this pot that I was going to use to cook the bananas in, because I boiled everything in this pot, because I only have two pots, really. And the other one... The greens are in there in the refrigerator. And then this one still has the chicken grease in it. And I think that that's why I forgot because this pot wasn't clean. And this pot usually sits over there on top of the charger, that straw charger, when it's clean. Right? So maybe that's why I forgot, y'all. But it's really easy. I, a couple people asked me about it in the comment section. And it's really easy. You just put the bananas down in some water and boil them for about 10 minutes or so until they get, you know, not too soft where it's falling apart, but just enough, let them get soft enough where you can take the, the peel off, you know. And once you take the peel off, you just, you know, put it on your plate and eat it with your meal. It's really easy, y'all. Hopefully one day I can show you, but I did forget this time, and I'm sorry about that. Okay, so I just cleaned up in the kitchen. I didn't do much in here. I just, you know, everything is still pretty much the same. I just took my cookbook that was sitting over here, took that off the counter, and I put it up there on the shelf, as you can see it. Um, and then I just kind of like arranged over here a little bit. This used to sit here, and now I have I, I just changed that around, and the coffee pot is still in the same area. But I still feel like I can get to my coffee maker a lot easier versus trying to go around this. And, you know, I just feel like that's arranged a little bit better. So that's it as far as what I did in here. Nothing much, you know, in here. I just basically cleaned in here. And then the bathroom, I didn't do anything in there, but I, well, that little plant over there, I cleaned in here too, but that little plant that's sitting over there, that was in the kitchen on the counter or by the coffee mugs or something at first. And then I just took that out of there. And I just put it in here instead of putting the two little birds and the hearts in here. I just set that over there on the back of the toilet. And then I already had those candles there, but I just kind of arranged it. And then this is still the same. I just dumped out the baking soda that was in there. Added my Fresh Scents um, laundry detergent thingamajig scent boosters. And it's just sitting in here and just giving this bathroom a smell. And so, yeah, so this is still the same. I think I'm going to go ahead and keep my picture up there. And yeah, so this is how this is how everything is looking, y'all. So I'm excited for what I've done. And I think it looks really good. This video is almost 20 minutes long. I wasn't expecting for it to be this long. Sorry I'm not on camera with y'all today. I'm just kind of, you know, like I said, I ain't got myself together. So I ain't trying to be on nobody's video, honey, looking like this. Because this is going to be up, okay? And so that's it. I'm getting ready to go out to... um 
the at home store and try to see if I can find some something over there so I can use this store credit. I'm getting ready to put the mirrors up so I'll show y'all that too once I get that done. And then, yeah, that's about it. Everything is just looking so good now, though. Like, I'm just so, 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 so amazed at how these plants over here just brought this dining room together with just some plants. You know, it just, that's just wonderful, y'all. So, thank you for watching, my lovely family. I love you. Um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. And until next time, I'm out of here. Peace.